Hello once again witchy people. I have been on a bit of a spending spree. Yes, another one. <laughs> so on Sunday I was uh, with this lady online because every Sunday around about half past six that's uh, GMT um, she has a crystal sale and she holds up everything and basically it's first come first serve you have to you know be really quick off the mark to get what you want and I was quick off the mark in getting almost everything I wanted um, <laughs> and my parcel arrived today so I wanted to share it with you and I'll show you the back of her card there I don't know if you'll be able to see that Uh, so it's got her Facebook on there. There's her Facebook. There we go. Facebook. Kiki Aura Crystals. So Kiki Aura Crystals. This plus crystals is her Facebook. Good fun. Um, so what I will do is I will change the camera view and get you looking down here and show you my goody goodies. <laughs> So, are you ready for this? Now, I'm, I'm not saying she's expensive. Candy is uh, the lady who does the sales. <clears throat> she's not expensive at all, by any means. What she sells is incredibly good quality. And it's a fair price. Um, incredibly fair price. So, she, she's not she's not cheap she would say she's inexpensive but she's not cheap if that makes any sense so here we go isn't this gorgeous so this is my raw orange calcite I mean as you all know I, I let's bring this down a bit I love raw crystals I absolutely I think possibly they hold a power that polished stones don't. That's just for my my own personal opinion. You know, I'm not saying that is how it is for everyone. That's just how it is for me. So raw orange calcite, and it's got beautiful, very rough edge just here. So there you go. That was my first bit. Oh, and she she sent me now. I um, I'm. I have very little selenite uh, left at all and I thought I wonder if she's going to have any selenite and she didn't but she sent me this piece of selenite for free it's like a free gift um, and it was just like she knew it was absolutely perfect just what I needed so lovely lo lovely little tiny uh, selenite now this I got because I haven't got any and I saw this and I thought I must have it's fire crystal and it's a proper fire crystal pebble you have to excuse my ring light there but I'm trying to isn't it absolutely gorgeous I would I would like to try and get some let's see if we can get the light up a little bit there we go so fire crystal Firestone, fire quartz, fire quartz. There we go, fire quartz. And my my daughter fell in love with this. Also, it's got some real sparks in it, and I think it's got a bit of healer stone in it as well. She said. So there you go. Just got all the little bits of plastic in here. <laughs> okay. When she started off the sale, this is what got me. So, and I know this is heated. It, it's, um, <laughs> I did write down my, what I ordered. Uh, titanium Aura. So I think it, it's treated um, in some way. Look at that. And it has points all over it. And it stands beautifully. So that's the titanium aura, which 
which is deciding now it doesn't want to stand it was standing beautifully stay <laughs> oh it wants to stand there there we go absolutely gorgeous and then um if i can find it i ordered this tiny uh tourmaline um, point it's a lovely little tourmaline point there I do like tourmaline tourmaline is one of those crystals that there are some crystals that aren't necessarily thought of usually for divination purposes but for me they are and one of those is black tourmaline and Another one is obsidian. I love working with obsidian. And talking of obsidian, here we have a beautiful obsidian point. Now she gave me this quite um, a reduced cost because it has a small, tiny, tiny, tiny little ding. I don't know if you it. there we go. Can you see that tiny, tiny little ding there? But I'm going to make a stand for this from at polymer clay and that won't be so and it'll be a stand that I can um, lift this out of when I need to so there we go that's uh, obsidian and this oh gosh and this is shell jasper also known as thousand or million eye jasper and I don't own any of this it says the woman who collects jasper it's got quite a big ding out of it actually the side but it's not really a ding it's just where the different layers are um i don't know if you'll be able to see that there but it was quite inexpensive and like I, said, I, I i've got most jaspers if you can name a jasper jasper i've probably got a small piece of it somewhere i have no picture jasper like this absolutely beautiful so that was another piece and finally and now i got two of these and my daughter fell in love with them my daughter thinks and no, it's not like i haven't got enough pendulums <laughs> but look at this so it has clear quartz here and then a piece of amethyst here which spins and then a piece of snowy quartz or white quartz at the bottom and I saw this first and I bought it and then something came up that I wanted even more and I thought mm -hmm, I'll have that as well then which was the black obsidian one and you can tell it's black obsidian because I ha if I hold this up to light you can actually see through it it's not um, that's how I um, so I'm just holding it up to light that's how I, I tend to when people say well how do you tell the difference between like black obsidian or tourmaline and black agate black obsidian is like a very 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 dark um crystal quartz and if you hold it up to the light you should be able to see some pieces where it's almost gray and you can see through it in parts it'll be slightly it'll be more opaque so there you go i treated myself and this was kiki aura crystals or candy and like i said look for her look for kiki aura crystals on facebook and uh yes have a look at what this lady has so and i was i mean she, th these are some of the smaller pieces she sells she sells um spheres big spheres she had a beautiful um obsidian sphere but i've got one I, i've got quite a large obsidian sphere so i i didn't need that one um she sells large points and yeah lots and lots and lots of things lots of different um like shaped even like pikachu shaped crystals and stuff so yes there we go that is my my little lot from uh from candy at kiki or crystals and this i i'm i'm going to love playing with this uh, playing is the wrong word i know but um using it I should say I just I am I just think it's one of the most beautiful things and I will tell you now 
I paid six pounds each for these and I think that's an amazing price this was only six pounds you know um, I think this was seven this was eight this was three I think but yeah these were six pounds each and I like I said I think that's an incredibly good price so there you go that is my little crystal haul and I, I was going, just going to say and that, that's it for now I'm, I'm not going to buy any more crystals but unfortunately or fortunately um, Candy has another sale on Sunday it's half past six GMT and uh, I advise everyone to come along not not if they necessarily want to buy something but just for the crack of it because it, it's a really good fun I, I had a wonderful time for three just over three hours I had an absolute blast so there you go that's it another haul video so I apologize for it being another haul video but I just had to share these um, and I think you'll agree what a beautiful little collection to have on display that's it thank you for watching witchy people I will be back very soon bye for now